Hi everyone, hello and welcome to Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here, we are back, and I'm so excited to be here with you guys. I hope everybody has had a fantastic couple of days since I saw you last in Happy Monday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here for you now and I have some great things to show you. So let's just jump right into it. I found some brand new floral stems and I want to show them to you first, all together. Look at how beautiful these colors are all in one bunch. So I'm going to get a vase and I'm going to put them just like this. And these are poppies. So I will show you the tag. It says poppies right on it. So here are the beautiful, beautiful pink ones. And I always check the other stems to make sure every flower is on it so that I don't buy one with it missing. So here are the pink ones right there. And then I love, love these, the color variation through there on all of these little floral heads right here. So beautiful. And then we also have this gorgeous, gorgeous teal color. So these are brand new. I've never seen poppies offered in the floral garden section. So, you know, I was like, I'm coming for you. The minute I came in the door and saw the new florals, I was on it. I was rushing down there with my cart and I was headed right for them. So that was an amazing find for me to decorate in a cute little vase in the middle of my table. And then I want to show you these. Oh my goodness. Oh my gracious. Look at this. This is a ladybug, a bumblebee, and a butterfly print. How amazing is that? These are fantastic. They spin so beautifully. This one's having trouble because the tag is like holding it up. But these have such a great pinwheel spin to them. And so there's the butterfly right there. This has the little stake so that you can pierce the ground and hold it in. So I got that one. I also got the beautiful bumblebee print. So, so pretty. Look at how cool it looks when it spins. I love them so incredibly much. And all three of them are going to look so cute next to one another. And I want to go to the beach and collect some rocks to bring them home and paint them and border my whole garden with them in ladybugs, butterflies, and bumblebees. So that's another project that I want to do. And then here's the ladybug one. Oh my dear, how sweet is this? So cute, all three of them together. Wicked, wicked excited about those. Now, also, I found some new gift bags. And I think that these would be absolutely beautiful to gift like a Mother's Day gift in. So I wanted to grab two so that I could give them away with gifts for Mother's Day. But also I had to show you guys these now, even though we've got a little bit until Mother's Day. I love these. They had several different choices that kind of looked like this. So it was like four different ones in this style line of gift bags. These are beautiful. Doesn't it look like a picture? And that glitter looks like the night sky with all of these beautiful florals and that gorgeous butterfly. I am in love with this gift bag. Absolutely in love with this gift bag. So I actually got two so that I could gift one away and I could also use the other one as a wall hanging or a door hanging piece so pretty beautiful gorgeous new gift bags i love that section so so much and then this one this is the second one i got in this style so here is that piercing beautiful beautiful blue right there doesn't it just looks like a painting it's so gorgeous in this gold all over those flowers right there makes it really pop the little gold butterfly that kind of just ties it all in with that beautiful background but will you look at the detail on that white butterfly and how realistic it looks it is such a well done well done bag and then this is the inside right there of the bag oh my goodness oh my grief that is so pretty i was really really thrilled with the new prints i wanted to grab a bunch of gift bags but if you guys have any special occasions coming up that you want to gift in, 
go to the bag section and check out and see if you guys have all the new prints. So I got those. Now I have a couple of birthdays coming up. So I did look at the wrapping paper and I saw some new wrapping paper. I love this. It has like that brown, um, almost like paper bag type of, of paper look to it. And then the beautiful foil candles all over it. So I got this style right here. And this one has, let me see, it has 30 by 48 inches of gift wrap. So I picked up this one right there. And then I also picked up this one with the same brown paper bag look in the background. And then this one says, happy birthday. Um, all over it in the that beautiful teal lettering or it's more like maybe a seafoam green type of color right yeah I would say so and then it has the same amount of gift wrap in it so it's not a huge roll by any means but enough to wrap a couple of gifts I got these two and then I thought it would just look nice with a clean white curly Q bow on it so that is what I got for this. And um, this has two pieces in it. So they come off in two bunches to give on two separate gifts. And I think that that's pretty amazing. So for $1.25, which every single thing in this haul is $1.25, I got some brand new two pack of bows and that gorgeous, gorgeous wrapping paper in those gift bags are just making me super happy, but I'll stop mentioning them now because we're over it, right? On to the next thing. <laughs> now, I did find some new mugs. I love mugs and I have a mug obsession. I have tried to tone it down for a while, so I haven't picked any up, even if I've seen a cute one, but these I could not pass up. So I found this one and it says, how do I take my coffee? seriously very seriously <laughs> and I just thought that that is so cute and they have really good coffee um I can't remember the brand of it but it usually comes in like a pouch type of bag and it's Richie's favorite coffee it almost looks like a Dunkin Donuts knockoff type of little bag and stuff one of those in here with a little bit of candy and that's a cute little nice gesture gift to give to somebody or keep it for yourself sweet sweet saying on it I just thought it was adorable so I wanted to grab it now I found this one as well and this says simmer down and roll with it how cute is that it's in the simmering pot and then the rolling pin simmer down and roll with it yes this will be my like, you got to chill, you got to go meditate cup to remind me to reel it in when I'm super hyper and I'm stressing myself out because I'm trying to do too many things all at once, which is very common for me. And then this one right here that says, let's get cozy with the cup on it, which I think is really cool because the handle's coming out this way and then they put the picture with the handle going that way. I just think it's a really, really cute cup. Can you picture it like around the holidays, Thanksgiving, Christmas, everybody has these matching cups, have hot cocoa in it with marshmallows in it and then it has that image on there. I just think it's so, so, so cute. So I picked up this cup. Oh, and by the way, each one of these cups has the image on the front and the back. So you're getting two images. So no matter which way you hold it, you're going to be able to see it. So I thought that those mugs were too cute for me to leave there. They did have a couple of other type of mugs with different sayings on it. I didn't grab those, but those three were my favorite. So I definitely wanted to pick them up. Now, in the way of drinks, I found some new stuff, and I thought that this was really awesome to try. So this is um, that brand right there. You see it? It says a good source of vitamins A and E, low calorie. It's zero sugar mango punch, mango, orange, and tangerine. It's 48 fluid ounces. So I always love to find the sugar-free stuff for Richie at the Dollar Tree. I think it's a really good pickup just for him to be able to have something 
in the house for him that has zero sugar or sugar free. So I love that I found this and I hope that he en enjoys it because once in a while it's nice to break up just having water all the time. So I grabbed this and I hope it tastes really good. I love tangerine and orange together so I think it will be a nice tangy summery taste. So I wanted to give that a shot. And then I found these two new packets. So these are drink packets and this is the Jelly Belly brand. The Jelly Belly, I think of like, you know, um, jelly beans. Hello, um, jelly beans. So this is sugar free as well. And this is Berry Blue on the go six drink mix packets. So I cannot wait to try that. And of course, I got a box for Richie to take with him to work. And then this one is the very cherry. So this one has six packets in it also, and it's sugar free. So I got one for the house of each, and I got one of each for Richie to take to work with him so that he can add a little dash of fun to his water. So there's that. I thought that that new stuff was really, really yummy. We have, I have those little Dollar Tree like candy jars that were in the party section for so long. The clear ones with the lid that kind of pulls off to the side. And I have drink packets all in one particular one so that when we want to go and grab one, we just take one out of that jar. So now I have some stuff to refill it because it's getting low. Now I did find... I did find these polarized sunglasses and I think that these were really, really amazingly beautiful. I did pick them up from my mom because my mom always had glasses that look like this. So the minute I saw them, I knew that they were her style and they are just there. Would you call that tortoise shell? I believe that's what she always called gla her glasses that look like this and they're polarized lenses. So that's amazing. And I think that these are really, really, really pretty. So very attractive sunglasses. They are, you know, they're coming out with all kinds of new stuff for the spring and summer. And it's just given me the happiest warm feelings in my, and my little butterflies are fluttering around in my stomach every time I go. Cause I'm like, what am I going to find today to spruce up the house, to gift away and Easter baskets, you know, to replenish the house, to decorate outside. There's just so many things coming to the store that are brand new. I've never seen in years past. So I'm absolutely excited. Now, this is from the tool bench section, and I want to put wreaths on each one of my windows around my house. So I thought these I would give a shot. These are the heavy duty suction cup hooks, and there's two pieces. So they look pretty good, and I've never tried these before, but I'm going to give it a shot on the outside of my house to put some really cute spring wreaths to dangle on each window. So I got three packages of these all together to go around the front side and back. So here they are. And then, you know, you bring the hook down because it will bend and come down and then I can hang the wreath from there. So I thought that those were awesome. Now for traveling, another thing that I picked up that was brand new. I thought it was really good to just have this on hand to go with me on my trips. This is from the spa um, April Spa Bath and Showers or Spa April Bath and Showers, whichever way it's written, contoured eye mask. So what's different about this is that, you know, it has the indentations so that it doesn't press up directly against your eyes. So I thought that this was amazing. It had three different color options for it. But of course, this is more me and my style and my color. So when we go away, I can bring those. I can kick back, whether we take the train to where we're headed on vacation. I can bring this and take naps. If we take a car ride and it's somebody else's shift to drive, this is really nice to just throw on and black out things so that I can get a good moment's rest. So I grabbed that and I was so, so excited. Now I do want to show you a couple of Easter things that I found because they're going to go outside and I'm excited to put them out. So I want to show them to you now. I did find this most adorable chickie. I think 
he is just sweet 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 coming out of the easter egg and look at his adorable little face it does have a string so that i can hang it up so here's the chicky and then there is the egg that he's coming out of it says happy easter i love that they added the little flowers with the gems as the center so this is really really pretty and i'm going to put that on my side door i just think she was bright and colorful and happy so i wanted to add her to outdoors so that my neighbors could see my neighbors all you know they just they enjoy my wild funkiness my house outside is just rainbows and color and pinwheels and flowers and usually garland all over the porch for some type of holiday and all kinds of stuff so everybody when they see me outside are like your house is the happiest house on the block and thank you so much for taking the time to like do that so that it you know it just brighten things up for everybody so i appreciate when they notice it and say something to me it makes me smile so i found the garland because i wanted to hang some on the railing outside put some on my little christmas tree out front in my house of my house this is from the happy easter line and this is nine feet of garland and i thought that this one was so pretty with the little speckled eggs all over it so i picked up this one to put on one of the railings of the porch one side of it and then i picked up the chickies too and this also has nine feet so look at how cute and adorable the little chickies are they are just so, so cute. They look like they're just trotting and walking along. So I picked up that one to go outside also in one of the areas, either on my porch or on the tree. And then we have this one, which is nine feet as well. And this one has the little bunny rabbits. So he looks pretty realistic too. The images are fantastic. And then there's the pink and white mixture of the garland. So springy, happy, fun, beautiful colors. It's just, it just brightens things up and makes the world a little prettier. So that's what I'm going to do with that. Now I have a bunch of stuff inside of this little Easter basket here. And I don't want to pull it all out, but I do want to show you this amazing, amazing Easter basket that I found today. And I love those chickies how adorable are they look at them marching along she has her head held high and this one has is lost because he didn't make it fully out of his easter egg and that one just looks like he is just like happy and chugging along after his little chicky friends so i just love this image it made me so it just made me smile it made me giggle looking at the antics of how they're walking with one another so i think that that's cute as cute can be and i also i just love chicks for easter they just make me really happy they're so bright and yellow and sunshiny looking i just think that the, they are the cutest i grabbed some candy to put inside of a couple of different easter baskets my kid my son and his girlfriend i called them my kids because his girlfriend is like you know a daughter i never had so i grabbed them a couple of their favorite which is the sour patch kids and this is the blue raspberry so good so 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 good so i did pick this up at the dollar tree i'm not quite sure because i don't really buy candy all that often at any other store either so i don't know if the dollar 25 price is good for um this size bag and this is a 3.6 ounce but i was there so i grabbed it and the blue raspberry yum 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 and then this one is brand new to me this is the strawberry i've never seen them come out with strawberry so i was so excited so i got two of each of these two for him and two for her and um they got to share one of these with mama because those look really really yummy especially i want to try the strawberry one so then there's that then I, the popping the bubble snap pops are just getting better and better every single time i find them this one is a bracelet and then that part right there just just play with it pop them i love the multi-color all throughout it it kind of looks 
tie-dye and you guys know I love tie-dye so I picked this up for the kids because they like all those fidget things it's just I used to always have fidget things too when I was younger I loved them uh, we, oh, what did we have we had the snap bracelets we had a bunch of really cool fidgety things back in the day back in the day like 80s and 90s <laughs> now we're just we're really far ahead I'm getting up there and I'm kind of freaking myself out when I think about like my era that started back in the 80s Woo! we're we're moving on up to the east side over here <laughs> we're, we're going to the hump we're going to the hump but I feel good so age doesn't count once you know you feel young in your heart so right here I found a yo-yo and I always got a yo-yo in my Easter baskets every single year and my mom can yo-yo really really good she's like a pro yo-yo chick <laughs> and I'll have to record her someday maybe if she lets me doing her yo-yo tricks so I definitely wanted to grab this one this is um create for awesome uh spinning tricks five plus and it just says yo-yo it says bam ultimate so I picked up the blue one, but they did have a couple of different color options in the yo-yo as well. Now I found a puzzle that just, I just, I just had to do it. I had to do it. Richie has got to make me this puzzle. This is a hundred piece puzzle. And <laughs> when you just look at them sitting side by side with their little knit pom-pom hats, this, this, that's just the happiness in a puzzle so I'm never throwing away this box I'm probably gonna cut cut out the images and craft with them maybe put them in a scrapbook or something about one of our camping trips you know because I take a lot of pictures of like squirrels and chipmunks and all kinds of little woodland creatures and I can put it in one of my like camping trip scrapbooks and use the images on the box this is too like cute to ever just toss out plus he'll make the puzzle for me and uh, frame it in one of the 11 by 14 dollar tree frames that they carry in their frame section so I love that <laughs> now I found I found some carrots some nine piece felt sticker carrots and these are really cute on Monday's haul I showed you that I found the Easter eggs the decorated Easter eggs and I also found the Easter bunnies so now I have found the carrots so I'm gonna do some wreaths I'm gonna make some crafts pertaining to Easter and I might actually use these on some of my barrettes as well to get ready for my craft fair of hair accessories to sell along with my jewelry so I thought that, that was too adorable to leave there for sure now in the pack pet section I did go and I got a kitty toy I got a kitty toy because one of my friends has a little kitty and I wanted to send something in the package for her cat and I thought that this little teeny tiny mouse with the little toy inside is just cute so it has a little rattle bell to it and they had a couple of different colors of the mice but I loved the white one with the gray so this is the one I picked out for the kitty. Grabbed that. Now, oh my dear, I don't know where to go next because there's just so many awesome things and we're already running out of time because you guys know I don't want to keep you too long. I know that they've added ads into the, into the, you know, half hour or so that I try to make my hauls. So I don't want to overextend my welcome and stress anybody out. And I want you to enjoy yourself and not feel like, oh my God, this is taking forever. And now I got to get through commercials too and wait to be able to skip them. I know how that can be. So I'm not going to do it to you. Now we're going to go through some of the Momoko stickers because I am sending them in friend mail. 
And so I picked up some of the cutest ones and I picked up these beautiful jelly bean ones right here from the Momoko brand. This is 141 pieces and they are just cute with their sunglasses on. Some of them are winking, they're dancing. They're just having a good old time for themselves. So I picked those up. Then I got these that have the uh, rhinestones all over them. There's 21 stickers in here. It's got a pie, a donut, ice cream. There's all kinds of things on here. Cookies and a piece of cake. So I thought that these are really, really pretty and pastel looking. So make a whole sticker basket for Easter time for somebody that likes to craft or just has a sticker collection. I know people that just enjoy having a sticker collection to flip through and they just have sticker books. I did as a kid and I wouldn't be opposed to it now either because stickers make you happy, make me happy. And then I found tacos. So, oh my goodness, the tacos are so cute. There's 34 stickers in here and these are the puffy ones. And so on Taco Tuesday, Pin a little taco to your to your top, taco to your top on a Tuesday for Taco Tuesday. <laughs> and that would be so cute to just celebrate Taco Tuesday all the way, all the way. Look at it even has hot sauce stickers and everything. This one is playing his musical instrument. These guys are jamming out. I'm just loving it, <laughs> loving it so much. Then I found this 70 piece sticker sheet and this one has all the movie and groovy signs on it. The peace sign and the hearts it says peace and peace, love, uh, peace and love. These are smiley faces. So these are just like, you know, promoting all that happiness and peace in the world. So I love those as well. Then I found the stickers. There's 117 stickers in here. And this is pizza party time stickers. Got the cool shades on, everything. Cute as cute can be. I found some eggs. I found eggs. There's 25 sheets and these are the puff stickers and they're, they're just a beautiful set of stickers. Look at, there's an angry egg. <laughs> There's an egg that has love in his eyes, sunglasses. This one's sleeping. I don't know. Is that one dead? I don't know. That one's sad because it has the X's over the eyes. I don't know what's going on with him. He's confused. His eyebrow is up. This one's crying. These are just so, so cute. Some little breakfast eggs. Too cute, too cute. And then we also have this last set. This is nine stickers and these are the shaker stickers. So shake, shake, shake. And they have all of these beautiful galaxy stickers on here. So amazing, beautiful, gorgeous. I love the moon and the stars, of course so pretty so i picked those stickers up and i was so excited to find all those momoko stickers because every time i've been there i've been like frantically just going through going through going through trying to see if i could find any more of the momoko stickers but i hit it just right on this day sometimes you just gotta be at the dollar tree bright and early in the morning i try to get there always like 15 minutes until the doors open so that I can be ready to go and they are just like newly stocked you get in you get out and you get what you came looking for or you get a surprise and find something that you have been looking for for a while so find out when your stores have their delivery days and try to go there right when the doors open that's my best advice I could give you and then I found these Westcott um, scissors. I almost called them stizzers because I've been known to do that throughout my life is called scissors, stizzers. Um, this is the medium and I don't know what that really means. Do you guys? So it says heavy, medium, and light. And there are like, me yeah, they're a medium size 
I believe that they're like a medium size. They're not a full size scissor that I'm used to seeing. These are glitter scissors. Yes. And this is seven inches. So it's durable stainless steel blades, lightweight, comfortable design, perfect for school and office use. And they had another three colors. They had a green one. Um, they had a blue uh, color and I believe that they had orange but these are pretty 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 so I picked those up because your girl over here just loves to craft in the comments below tell me what do you what is your favorite hobby to do I I just love I love crafting I love making jewelry I like scrapbooking I just, I just dibble and dabble in so many different things, but w what are some hobbies that everybody else enjoys? Do you guys like to read? You know, do you like to take pictures? I love photography, love photography. I have my camera with me everywhere I go. So just out of curiosity, share with me some of the things that you guys enjoy doing in your free spare time that fill you up with happiness. I would love to know what you guys do. Now, last but not least, because I cannot wait to give this to my mom. She's going to be so excited. The, um, the Road to Walden, 12 Life Lessons from Thor, um, Thoreau's Cabin. So this is a place that is really close to us. We go to it all summer long. It's called Walden Pond. It's in Concord, Mass. And we go to it quite frequently. It is an amazing place. At some point, I am going to go there and do a vlog of me being there. It's just, if anybody knows the story of Walden Pond, and it's just unbelievable. So this book originally went for $16. It went for 16 So I found this for you, Mom. I'm going to give it to you right after this haul is over. So you're going to have the book before you even see the haul. And I am excited that I found it for you. There's so much history in Massachusetts as well as everywhere else, I'm sure. Um, but we're really, like, it's amazing to see some of these things that we just grew up being around that is, it's just such a part of history. So this book is really, really good and I'm going to give it to my mom. So that is it. Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree haul, guys. I hope you had an amazing, amazing time here with me today, and I love you guys, and I hope you guys have a fabulous couple of days until I see you next on Happy Saturday Dollar Tree haul. So make sure you come back with me. I do Dollar Tree hauls here on this channel on Saturdays, Mondays, and Wednesdays, and I absolutely love it. And I have so much fun bringing you fun stuff from the Dollar Tree as I find it. I love sharing it with you. It's just me hanging out with my friends and just shopping with you guys. So I enjoy every single bit of it and then getting to talk to you guys and hang out with you afterwards. So that's it. Please subscribe, like, share, comment down below and hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that I upload a new video. And I hope that you guys stay happy, healthy, safe, strong, loved and blessed. Definitely kind to one another forever, just forever and ever and ever and always. And I'll see you in a few. So I'm going to head out, go have dinner with my family. And I love you guys all so, so much. And I'll see you in a few days. Bye everyone.